So this video is going to show you how to do this. Bring up WAMP control panel here by typing in monkey or whatever else you want instead of the boring old local host. So to do that what we're going to do is we're going to edit something called the host file. Basically you're going to click start, computer, <coughs> um, obviously make sure you have WAMP running first. <coughs> And instead of um, going through the directories here, I'm actually just going to search for host right here. Uh, we don't want Windows old. We want the actual Windows folder. Actually, you know what? <coughs> I'm going to go ahead and find it manually. Windows System 32 Drivers ETC and here's the host file right here so make sure you have notepad plus installed so I'm gonna right click here on the host file edit with notepad and as you can see here I have monkey uh, these are just comments Windows actually ignores these um, monkeys here local host is here so I'm gonna go ahead and change this to hello and then I'm going to do control S to save. It's going to come up with this window here. Just click yes. Hit yes again. And then you got to click control S again to save. To make sure it's saved up here. Go back. Instead of monkey, I'm going to do hello. Forward slash. And then we have our new WAMP control panel. And that's how you change it from localhost to a custom name. And if you want to bring it back to localhost, just do localhost. Control S to save. Now if we hit refresh. Uh, this won't do anything because we just change it. So we're going to do localhost again. And that's it. And that's how you change the localhost uh, URL. Thanks for watching.